This is Corvette on Rigamaster Evos. Morning. Morning, morning. Did everybody else leave? Um, I mean, no, no, we're all here. Oh, okay. <laughs> So year 11 was yesterday and uh, like last year we we're trying to do a two day event. I think it went well. I don't know how much coverage Dirk got because I haven't gone over the video. Hopefully you got enough coverage of the meet. If not, we're going to get some footage today. But uh, everything went smoothly and um, we're going to do another cars and coffee thing for all the people out of town and hang out for a few hours before they get back home. So should be a, a good morning. Get some coffee in there. Chat with some friends. What? Mm -hmm. What's that? AP Racing? Yeah. Those are white sports? Yep. Uh, Look, this is running. Chasing Jays? Yep. It's pretty nice. Sorry. You want to know? No, no. It was so funny. Over there the other day. Oh, he's been long gone. Oh, that's right. Yeah, no, I talked to him. Um, oh, you did? Yeah, I know that he was back. Yeah. No, the reservoir doesn't work. It's just so old. Yeah. yeah. How you been, man? I'm bad. It's not going to be. It's not going to suck it back. The pants? The pants are awesome. Oh, oh shit. They fit great. Thanks. I don't want. They, I don't want them too tight. Sorry. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, I don't know how high these to you were. So. <laughs> Dwayne's saying your overflow doesn't work. But, uh, yeah, it's not. It's not working. I don't know why. Because you're supposed to go down. Uh, yeah, it has to go down. Go down. This thing has to be down here. It's just an overflow. It yeah. Won't it won't overflow, it's flowing to the bottom. So you want it to flow up top. So the hose has to be connected to the bottom side. Yeah. I'm super minimal. Silicone. <laughs> That's my smallest. Yeah. <laughs> Good to know, good to know. I, had, like, yeah. I was wondering why it wasn't working. <laughs> I, I always looked at it, I'm like, why isn't this fucking thing working? Yeah. Oh, Sucking air. You're probably getting air in your <laughs> No, it's, it, 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 it's fine in there, it's just that. I don't know what's up. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, so get, get the reservoir that has the... Yeah, you need a, a bottom. Yeah. Okay. 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 This is why people go to Carlos and coffee. Yeah, not for the coffee, but for the knowledge. <laughs> right? <laughs> Stand right here, get please. Get back over there. Get back over there. Thanks. Hey, come here, folks. Yeah, look at these guys. Yeah, be proud of your checkers. Yeah, no, 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 no. Let's, let's do that. Fucking star that. You fools used to do. Hey, you got to step in one. Oh, there yeah. you go. A little bit more. There we go. What group chat was this? How do we get it on this group chat? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Yep. Morning. <laughs> Damn, you are staring at me. You know, I'm happy to do for a lap. <laughs> what? Whoa! Why would you do for a lap with us sitting on? That made me feel uncomfortable. Yo, that's just What are you talking shit about? Oh, we're just talking, me and Dwayne, we're planning on sitting on these and going for a little parade lap. Oh. Christian gets his car running. Yeah, with the extra zip tie at the end, too? No, no, we gotta take it out. Oh. <laughs> oh! Oh shit. It's all like ruined. Everything was just Good job. Oh shit. Hold on, hold on. Good job. I'll go back in. <laughs> you took it right. It actually snapped. Yeah. Christian! You broke, snapped. Your, you broke your hood pin. Exactly. Oh, they're cheap. I this can't. isn't going on the time right, on the YouTube right. channel, huh? No. Damn. Damn, dude. Damn. 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 Not polished? Like no. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. We'll see if I make some drive next year. Yeah, I snapped that shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, wire. It's all right with the back. Yeah. Uh -huh. dope, it comes with the plugs already, too. It's already wired in. You just plug it right into the tail light. Yeah, so I've seen that right now. I've never seen that before. Yeah. Yeah, because I have mine through the, through the back side of the. Mm -hmm, yeah. So I kind of took it in and brought it up to the back. Yeah. You can still see it, but that's that's dope. Yeah. I mean, I think, like, oh you know, I was thinking, I ran it through the quarter panel at first, but then I kind of like things just laid out like a race car. Yeah. So yeah. Great. I wonder who made that. Uh, it's some guy. <laughs> he's, he's, I heard he's like kind of short, so you might just miss him. Yeah. He might just look right he's past you. Looking right past you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he did? Oh, that's cool. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I wonder who did that. It's just cool, man. Some guy. Whatever. Some fucking guy. <laughs> Pretty good turnout. Morning. Guys from the Pacific Northwest stacking down Seattle area. Cars coming by. Later, bro. Thanks Later. For us. Thank you. Supercharged B series. These guys always cruise out together. It's not one. Beautiful boy.
This car has such a cool style to it. Look at the shift knob. It's Team Beautiful Boy. As you can probably tell by now, I am in Las Vegas for the annual SEMA show and uh, might as well call it the 2019 Super Show because uh, that's what we're going to be seeing a lot of this year, but I'm kind of excited. I know a lot of people are complaining about seeing too many of the same cars over and over again, but I mean, it's a new car from a big manufacturer, so what do you expect? There's going to be a lot of builds. Well, it's a great car to be honest, which is from my experience with it. So, let's see how this week goes. Hopefully it doesn't get too crazy. Can meet up with the guys in a little bit. Check out some new cars. Getting to Toyo Tread Pass now because I kind of want to beat the crowd and get to those cars before it gets too insane. One of the cool things about this year's show is that Yokohama is back and uh, doing a huge display outside this year. The section that used usually filled by the dub cars or the dub section. You guys see this display they put together this year. It's pretty awesome. Forefront is Garrett Jarbo's A90 Supra. Work my service ones. It's a full Advan livery. Just they had some friends involved with getting this livery on. the pandem kit i know everybody has it but the kit actually looks great for this car considering how the stock body is the kit makes it so much more aggressive you know such a cool setup So, randomly out in the middle of nowhere, in a gap, this is the new Rocket Bunny TRA Kyoto version 3 S13. I don't know why it's here. This is just kind of like an empty area where people are lining up to get into different halls. Maybe they didn't have enough room for this car, so they just shoved it here in the spot. Which is perfect for me because then I can get photos of it uninterrupted. I still like the original Rocket Bunny kit for the S13 more, but this isn't too bad at all actually. I really like the Pandem kit for it. What a strange place to put this car. Dash and everything too. Crazy. Crazy. It's entering the Toyo Tread Pass area now. It's 
some interesting Subaru Legacy Wagon. Seats. Six Series Beamer with a Coatner kit. I think this is designed by Kamira, I believe, if I remember correctly, from Tokyo Auto Salon. And I saw the original one there. It's cool to see this kit in the US now. It looks pretty good on this one. I actually just met the owner while I was walking over here. We got a nice little chat. He says he doesn't really like the rear that much, but I mean, I don't mind it. This is the rear quarter panel, since I didn't get a good look at it in Japan, because the car was kind of roped off. How wide it is. Sunny. Hayashi Street Wheels. It's a Bride Hysterix seat in there too. Or Bird Hysterix, I mean. You guys can see it. It's in there. Crazy shadows right now. This Varus Evo 5 actually belongs to my friend. Rowie, who works at Mackin Industries. I actually got this car a couple years ago and it was like in pretty bad shape. I had to kind of go through it and restore it. Put a full Varus kit on it. That guy doesn't care that I'm doing stuff, I'm just standing there. But yeah, it's an Evo 5 that's it's a legit Evo 5, it's not a Mirage conversion or anything. We had an Evo 10 before too, and the, I think he actually got rid of it to build this thing, which is kind of a good choice. Yeah. The Voltex Wing, Volk C28s, this is the Club Sport 2s. J. Craze, Alexis LC500, Liberty Walk kit. It's a green vinyl wrap that actually has it's airbrush to give it that like patina look, that old weather look, and give the car some more depth. Rotiform wheels. From here, you can get a better idea of the airbrushing. I'm gonna airbrush this license plate. Right next to it is the auto fashion. 240Z build, a full speed form kit from Japan. Pretty sure it's the only kit here right now, maybe one of two. But they just finished this car in time for SEMO. I wouldn't even say it's finished because there's need so much stuff still. 
You got the outside exterior area finished. It looks pretty good. This is a nice kit. So. series Gen V ITV conversion direct injection thing. it's carbon oh go for it you're good thank you Ferrari 355. Yeah, it's pretty cool. That's yeah, really cool. I didn't know that they were gonna do this wrap though, or this color. That's yeah, great. It looks really cool with it all complete because I've only seen it like in pieces, you know? Or like the teasers. Yeah. That's really cool. And the wheels work really well with it too. See the twin turbo setup? I know. Yeah. How do you even do that? Uh, 3D printing? Boy, this metal though. <laughs> <laughs> Before the red one, right? Some updates. The race car. Last couple months. It's got a few JP racing brakes, painted Advan and Yokohama on the tires. It's really cool. Talking about Hondas while we're looking at Ferraris. No, it's a Ferrari. I seen it. It's from a shop, right? Osaka. Yeah. Yeah, this thing is cool, man. Yeah. Super wide. The wrap almost makes it like look less wide than how we had it when it was just like so raw. See the body lines? Yeah. Kind of hides it all. Yeah. Very interesting. Even the banner has uh, Yeah, everything. Even that. It's like, can you just go to Avery and get this? Is that how it works? Is that how it works? Uh, they re every hour they release a new pin, either here or at the other booth in front of the tower. Daniel Wu's Honda S800. And um, flares. These rebarreled steams.
damage to the original DTM E30 M3 race car. Cool, you can see steps of how they put Hot Wheels together. See this here? See how Hot Wheels is made. It's just really great for us to be able to see that. cool, I like this. Yeah, concept of completion is pretty yeah. badass. <laughs> it's a cool diagram. I will just cut this whole thing off. <laughs> and then it becomes this. Yoshihara's Corolla. Oh yeah, you guys haven't seen this car yet. It's pretty sick, dude. Yeah, first one. Yep, first one. I like the side exit exhaust. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Powered 8.6, owned by Dai Shihara. You guys saw from the unveiling at Bowls. <laughs> hi, hi, sir. This is part of Honda or not? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you consider it Honda? Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm sure all the Honda people are on the car. But... Yeah. Dude, I bet you people are looking, they don't even know what the hell they're looking at. So. <laughs> so, like, is this the new super engine in here? <laughs> <laughs> kind of small for the new engine. Yeah. That's cool. Was it always roped off, or did something happen? Or is it planned to be roped off? Yeah. Was it planned to be roped off like this? Yeah, oh. which kind of sucks for the view, but... Yeah, for the photos and stuff. Cool. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, this is a crazy booth. Yeah. They didn't have this last year, right? They had a different location. Yeah. It wasn't a two-story, but a little bit bigger. Yeah. Oh, they usually have it in the central hall. No, no? Right there. Oh. Yeah. Spider. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. It's actually having, uh, it's not a drivable condition yet. It's not plumbed yet. Like, yeah. for you to have made that choice. It's a brew tooth right now. <laughs> yeah. You that it's modern. For you to have made that choice. Like, I have a Type R2, so, like, just understand the, the weight oh, difference. Oh, you have a FK? Yeah, FK? I have a, um, Integra Type R2. Oh, I see, So, yeah, just I see. to go forward and see, like, you know, this being the new platform, This is it. As I said, it's not quite running yet. Yeah, it's still missing some stuff. But, and then they flipped the intake manifold. You know, I was talking to Dur saying that you make a block off plate for this custom uh, exhaust manifold, custom intake manifold, put the, you know, put regular injectors back in it. Mm -hmm. Should be. You yeah. Chris is gonna make a custom intake manifold for it. Okay. He's the one that made all the mounts and everything. That's cool. It almost kind of fits in there, kind of snugly, you know. Yeah, no, it's good. I like I think, um, yeah, uh, Aaron put it on a Devolts thing. That's funny. Yeah. I'm excited about these tires. So this is going to be kind of like a toy car, like a weekender 
This is yeah. This is just his like his, his own build. Just for himself. A eighty six R. See, there's just no plastic trim anymore. That was a hard. Unless it was hard. That's what I was talking about. It's all over. Yeah. It's yeah. You can say amber. Do you think that's that if you made it hard? That's what I was under the impression. Manifold looks good. Mm hmm. It's like a very um, CNC. Yeah, raw C. Ready built Pandem A90 Supra. It's so weird how there's so much room back here. It's just like battery in there. Yeah. Oh, hello, sir. First thing that popped up is she. Really? Wow. Thank you, thank you. I missed your show again. Yeah, that was pretty good. Yeah. Missed out. Yeah, 11. Maybe next year. Well, I mean, every year you have to do SEMA, you're going to miss it. So. Yeah, it depends on the projects. Yeah. But I was already on the road at 6 a.m. So. It was just bringing this one here, right? Is there another one? This one, and we have a street spec one that we did. That's the one that you did earlier, right? Mm -hmm. Was it a blue one? Artisan, a uh, black one. Black one. Yeah. Oh. And the Suzuki Jimny. Oh, yes, I saw that. Did you see that out there? Yeah, that's in a good spot. That was a fun one too. Yeah. How long did that one take? That's the one that keeps going. That one didn't take that long, right? Is mm -hmm. this Mira working on it or did you have to do a bunch of stuff to it? No, the Jimny? Yeah. But, uh, Mira didn't do any of that. Oh, really? Yeah, that's a uh, car style. Mm -hmm. 